So what about the appendix? It's not to be vestigial, right? Not anymore. In fact, the story of the vermiform appendix is very similar to that of the palatine tonsils. We used to think these structures were vestigial, and then we found new evidence, and so we changed our minds. There is no, there are no vestigial structures. Everything has a use, God made. You think it's something useless? Completely useless? Make a, they make up a story about how it used to be used in the past, like the whale's legs. Oh, by the way, Pluto called in about that whale 1919 washed up on the beach. Uh -huh. I found the video and watched it. Okay. There are no pictures of it. No, they said it had leg bones, three three bones, about a meter long, and ended with a fist, a, 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 like a lump of bone on the end. It wasn't, anyway. And that's only one. Who did that one marry? But this has very little to do with evolution. This is just the way that medical science has always progressed. Medical science has progressed in many ways. They used to teach, if you're sick, take out your blood. You have bad blood, doctrine of humors. Yeah, and so George Washington died. I'm glad they progressed past that. When the Bible said, right right next to George was a Bible that said, the life of the flesh is in the blood. If they'd have read that, they'd have, he might still be alive. Yeah, well, he, he would live longer anyway.